So, watching the death of Stalin is a little bit like when you play a game of Cards Against Humanity. At face value, it's a lot of fun and you have a really great laugh, but when you kind of think past all the dark, dark implications of what you've just participated in, you can't help but feel just a little bit guilty. And that's kind of what we end up seeing with this film. The film itself is, um, is a comedy ba which is based around the death of Stalin and it sort of manages to make you laugh out loud. It's very funny, it's got a very good cast, it's got lots of really good kind of elements to it. But I guess at the same time it kind of looks at the, the deep and dark paranoia and horrible revisionist history that was going on in the Soviet Union and despite the fact it makes you laugh you kind of feel a bit rubbish coming out of it which is exactly what the film is trying to make you feel so in that way well played um, it's one of those films that you kind of feel like probably in a, in a few months time should be going up for nominations for awards but potentially won't um, but regardless it's a very very good film it's very clever it kind of kind of really well plays the black comedy element but kind of is also incredibly bleak and um, yeah I guess made me really want to go back and revisit the period of history that it's about so there's not a lot of reason not to like it I guess if the average cinema ticket was um, ten pound you'd probably say that this film deserved um, maybe 850 um, of your British pounds so, yeah, it's not the film everyone's talking about this week, but it's a lot better than Geostorm, so go see it.